What's up my dudes, Val here, and today I was asked to check out Anime Destiny for you guys. It's a brand new tower defense coming out, I believe, on Saturday. It comes out on the 9th, and that, depending on where you're at, it changes. Uh, but you can check out inside the Discord the exact release date for you because they haven't set the time zones. I'll have the Discord in a pinned comment and a description of the video. But yeah, I've been asked to go ahead and check it out. So today we're going to go ahead and check it out. And you guys can probably tell by now that this is meant to be a AA remake in ways. This is an anime adventures remake. Uh, like so many tower defenses nowadays, they want to try to recapture the magic that anime adventures created for so many people. So they pretty much remade everything and i'm going to go ahead and look at it i haven't looked at a whole lot um they have given me some stuff to check out so let's go ahead and let's look at it first i want to see the summon animation is it the same it's almost the same it's a little sounds a little different uh but this is pretty much the same too so i don't know if you guys will believe me right but basically i was uh i was getting ready to render this video came on here for a screenshot and I came here, I hit inspect, and I saw this. Um, imagine my surprise. Look at this. I wonder if they all have it. Now I gotta check. And yeah, now I gotta check. Now I gotta check to see if other ones have it as well. Um, let's check out Sung Jin Woo. Oh, and this is a continuation of the fight. Okay. Um, I don't. Really, I just wanted a thumbnail, but hey, this is pretty dope. This is actually hella dope. I wonder if it's like this animation anytime you pull a mythic. This is super sick. Yeah, no, this is super dope. Arise. Oh, he even says arise. Okay. That's super sick. Okay. Alright, well, now I gotta see. Now I gotta summon until I get a mythic. Um, yeah, we're just gonna go until, like, a mythic pops up. Yeah, we're gonna go until a mythic pops up. Is there an auto sell feature? I, I gotta see if whenever you pull a mythic, if that's what happens. Is that really, really sick animation? Uh, there isn't an auto sell, so we'll have to back out and sell every now and then our fuse. But we're going until we get a mythic. Uh, I don't know how long this is going to be, so I didn't want to add more to the video, but hey, takedowns required to evolve. Okay, so that's a thing here, too. I didn't even notice that before. Alright. I don't want to click past the animation, because I know that they, whenever the animation plays, it's like, it's different, right? So we're gonna go till we get this animation. Like I said, I I just wanted to do a screenshot for a thumbnail. But then this happened. And now you got my curiosity. Now I gotta know if it plays on summon. So we gotta go till we get Gojo. Because Gojo's on the banner right now. We gotta go till they kick me out. Alright. Okay, we just got to keep it pushing. Not enough space. All right, so we got to sell some stuff. Let's sell mode. Um, Just go down the list. Oh, this is so smooth. Normally, it's chunky, right? Normally, in other games, like, dude, they've landed a lot of smoothness of, like, navigating things in this game. Like, genuinely. All right, so... Um, yeah, I gotta re-edit my video a little bit now. And put this somewhere. I, if you're watching this, I don't know when you're watching this in the video. I might even stick in the very beginning, to be honest. And then cut into the sub my dudes. I might do that. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. I'm just gonna stick at the very beginning. Because, um... I, to be real, I, I, this is like the coolest part of the whole thing. I love sick animations. These animations are dope. So I really want to see if it plays when you summon a mythic. So we're just going to be here summoning until we get a mythic. 
Um, my luck is really bad, so this could be a while. <laughs> I don't know how many times in the AA I've had to, uh, I've had to pray. I wonder if there even is a pity. Well, if there is, we're gonna find out, aren't we? Alright, so... I just want the screen to cut to some type of cinematic with Gojo or something. Give it to me. I have to see it. I have to see. I have to see if it's just like purely an inspect animation, or if it's like whenever you summon a unit, this is what you see. Come on. Give it to me. Um, I'll probably just cut to whenever I get him. Uh, but this is pretty much the same, too. This is pretty dope. Yeah, this is just like AA. It's actually smooth, honestly. Um, one thing I noticed when a lot of new tower defenses, whenever you, like, summon, right? It's really chunky to actually click through the summons. But, like, if I put my... If I just, like, mash it, right? Yeah, it's actually pretty smooth. Yeah, that's actually hella smooth. That's nice. Alright, so next up is Ascent. What is this? Beginner, Summon Ra Oh! Wait, that's actually pretty dope. And you get reroll shards for it? Oh! That's actually cool. And look, you get units for doing this. For completing these challenges. Wait, that's actually super sick. I like that a lot. That's actually really cool. Um, current challenge. Da -da -da. So this is just like how AA was. Uh, you can see stat cubes are tied to it. Luck? Is that like a luck potion? Or something? Or is that like a four leaf clover? It might just be something. Here we have stat rolls. We can go ahead and check out... Um, let's stat roll on Sung Jin Woo. Let's, let's do this. Reroll. Are you sure you want to reroll all stats? Oh, yeah. We're going to reroll all stats. Check it out. AAA. All right. Um, we're going to reroll till we get like an S. I want something good. S minus? No, nah, we want better. All right, let's 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 go for something way better. SS, there we go. Now we're just going to reroll these using individual rerolls. Let's see if we can make something like really cracked on him. Okay, let's cook. Dude, my luck is awful. <laughs> Oh, man, my luck is doo-doo buns. All right, all right, all right, all right. We got this. We got this for sure. Sure, sure. Um, Let's see. I guess we're just going to... Yeah, I don't want to sit here all day, so we're just going to go with, like, A's or whatever whenever we get it. Okay. A minus. Good enough. Good enough. Oh, I clicked past an A minus. Oh, there we go. All right, so we have S, S, A, and then S minus. Um, Is there, ev like, evolutions? Oh, wait. Wait, I can evolve the rares? Oh, that's so cool. Okay. So you can evolve rares into legendaries. All right. And then Shin Room, you would need all this to actually evolve. That's pretty dope, actually. I like that a lot. Now, more importantly, where's the traits? I want to see the traits. Um, Let's see. Areas, playroom, da-da-da, summon, evolve, challenge. We got to find the traits. Let's see. Right here? I think this might be it. Yeah. All right. So, trait chances. Prodigy, Executioner. This unit deals devastating damage, especially to bosses. Blessed with holy power. This unit operates beyond the normal worlds. Da, da, da. Unique and then tr golden. So, this is pretty much one-to-one -one of AA's, um, AA's traits. All right. So, let's go ahead. Let's look. You can see it takes five shards to reroll on a mythic. What about a secret? anymore it's only one shard to reroll on a secret Ooh, that's pretty cool actually all right so we're gonna do this we're gonna reroll some more and see if we can get like unique or something really sick um i want to see also i don't think we'll get unique right away so i do want to see if they did one thing that aa didn't that i really hope they did because it was really really annoying how aa didn't have it uh but first we gotta roll a mythic okay so yeah it, they did add reroll confirmation which means, you know what it's time for? Uh, you guys can't see what I'm doing, but you know what it's time for? It's time for... Oh, yeah, we're cooking now. Uh, there is a lockout that you can see happening. 
That part is true. There's definitely a lockout happening, which is really, really good. Um, it's just something to keep people from basically rolling past Mythics. AA never had that. AA, you could just shotgun roll stuff, and you could roll past Mythics all the time. And it was really, 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 really frustrating. Uh, I really didn't like it. So I'm really glad that there is a good bit of lockout to this, because um, otherwise it'd be few, it would be really sad. Really, really sad if, uh, you know, you went to roll a mythic and it just didn't, didn't happen. So, let's go ahead, let's check it out, and then we're going to play the game and see how the game plays out. And that's kind of where we're at. I'm really curious to see if they added, like, any type of speed manipulation, or if we're just, like, raw AA up in here. Um, dude, my luck is doo-doo. I know my luck is bad. I, I know my luck is bad. I'm, like, the worst person to showcase gambling mechanics, I swear, man. My luck is just so bad. Alright, so, let's go ahead. I'm just going to, like, do it manually. Because we're just going to stop. I don't want to do this all day. So, we're just going to stop on something, hang out, and then go... Let's see. And then go actually test the game. Um... Dominated 3? I probably should have stuck on that, huh? Sharpshooter. There we go. Good enough. All right, so we're going to grab this now. We're going to equip, and then we're going to equip the shiny Ignis that we got as well. Uh, some really cool units. We're going to pick Nami. Wait, we got a Nami with strength three from pooling. That's so funny. She's going to go boxing. Oh, titles right here. Based. Beta title. There we go. Oh, no. I'm a beta. Anyways, um, let's go ahead. Let's go normal. Let's select start. Now, I just want to see like how fast it is because... I do miss AA like everybody else, but at the same time, one of the big things was the fact that AA really, um, it was really slow. So I'm really curious to see if they like fix that or if this like retains that, uh, 3000 to place. Uh, perhaps I've made a mistake. Perhaps I've judged too harshly. Uh, that's a good that's a that's a large quantity of cash needed so let's go ahead let's do this we're gonna place Bulmy and 800 to place 250 on return that makes her about like 40 percent cost efficient so now we're just going to chill no upgrading Bulmy, no nothing we're just gonna let the waves go by until we do that all right, so next we're going to do and place Ignis here. Yeah, we're going to place Ignis right here. Oh, one out of three. Okay, so cool. It tells you on placement exactly like how many you have. So now let's see Ignis's attack animation. That's what I'm curious of. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. All right, so now we're just going to chill out, wait until um, Sung Jin Woo with a 10.88 SPA. Maybe I should have stat rolled on him. Uh, but we're going to chill out and wait for Sung Jin Woo. He's full AoE on placement. Okay, the cost makes sense now. Uh, the cost definitely makes sense. So we're going to do this now. He's two placement as well as full AoE on placement. All right. Um, I get you. So we're going to do this. All right. And then we're going to... I'm, I'm going to be real. Like, it is kind of... Uh, they are kind of slow, just like the old and just like AA was but at the same time it doesn't feel as slow right um, balancing seems to be pretty decent like it seems to be pretty good pretty pretty well balanced the SPA is being high to me is fine as long as the damage compensates like for it and it looks like it does so it seems to be pretty well balanced um, everything seems to be pretty good for this game yeah here we just place another Sung Jin Woo. You can see 4,000. You get that 400 attack increase, SPA down, range up. Um, all in all, pretty good. And look, it tells you your stat lines up at the very top. You have S, S, A minus, S minus. Yeah, no, this is actually this is actually pretty good. I'm actually pretty, uh, pretty surprised by all this. This game kind of came out of nowhere, didn't it? Um, this game kind of came out of nowhere, and it looks, it looks good. Uh, balancing seems good. Everything seems really good. Um, I'm really, really curious to see uh, how this plays out because, like I said, this is pretty much just like AA was. It, it is like it see it feels a teensy bit faster. It's not like I'm fully watching paint dry uh, like AA, but at the same time, it's uh, definitely 
on the slower end i can see a lot of people wanting speed manipulation i wonder if they'll add it i don't know uh speed manipulation though in my opinion is a must in modern um modern games oh he goes from full aoe to line okay uh does he gain anything extra while being line let's see but yeah in my opinion speed manipulation is like a must in today's tower defense game so i'm curious if they'll add it if they'll add like two times speed or whatever it'll be really interesting to see um i do think this game has a lot of promise though like a lot definitely a lot of promise i'm very very curious to see how well it does in the long run uh but yeah it's pretty dope all right and now we're here with the boss the boss zarbon uh zarbon i wonder if it transforms just like it did in a let's find out in fact does not in fact he just got blasted five minutes for story that's actually pretty good it's actually really good story time five minutes of stage i think is really 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 good anyways let me know what you guys think in the comment section below thank you guys for watching i'll catch you guys in the next one peace